Everybody, welcome back. We're cooking up some some interesting. Oh, hello! Some interesting Balatro runs here. We if we do black steak, we can unlock a new deck. The only deck that has access to it is checkered deck. Shops can have eternal jokers. Small blind gives no reward money. Okay, eternal jokers can't be sold or destroyed. So I'm just leveling with you. We're probably going to be cooking up flushes here. And I see that we have a free rare Joker incoming. It's just the way I like to play the game. What can I say? Okay, how do we make this work? We kept hearts because we had more face cards, which are worth more chips. The man is actually doing math now. This is pretty good. Any, any flush enablers for score we take. And then I think if you beat the black stake, you get the anaglyph deck. Holy cow. Eternal Joker, earn $4 at the end of round, but you can't sell it. Yeah, I don't think we'll be taking that one. We'll definitely take this one, though. If you play a single six, you get a Spectral card. Very interesting. How about a Hermit? Would have been a great opportunity for a Hermit. I'm just going to say it. Now, here's the deal. You could convert some spades to hearts, but realistically, flushes are going to be so easy for us to make already. We'd probably be better off cooking up some bonus cards to make our flushes worth more points in case we don't get jokers. How about some enhanced hearts or spades? Somebody up there likes us. Gold seal on a lucky card. Red seal on an eight. If we could get like Fibonacci, that would go pretty hard. Remember, we're not buying it because it's eternal, which means we could never get rid of it. That's $4 per round for free, sure, but it takes up a joker spot, which is priceless. Now, we, I think now, even though we don't get money from this, we want to play because we get Spectral cards. Create a copy of a random Joker, destroy all other Jokers. Interesting. <laughs> I, uh... I don't know, okay? I don't know how to feel about that. Uh, I do know creating two Spectral cards would be kind of sick. That would be kind of sick. What has me scared is do we have enough points to even make it through this without any other jokers? It's gonna have to be a heck of a hand, brother. It's gonna have to be a heck of a hand. You'd love to see a, a fairly high value spade fall here. We're cooking. <laughs> now we are losing a hand every time we do this, right? Uh, you already count every played card in scoring. It came for free with your freaking flush. I don't think we want to convert cards to hearts. Obviously, we would love to buy... You're useless to me. We have no choice. We, we need Malt. So we, we take Magician for a lucky card that hopefully can get us out of a jam and then level up. This isn't a freaking flush, bro. This isn't a flush at all. I'll level up four of a kind. That's, that's what we're working with here. Okay, next round. This is a scary place to be. 1,500 points doesn't seem like much. Kind of is a lot. Um, just being real with you, okay? I don't think that I can afford to wait for a six. Now, I really needed that lucky card to pop. We do have some bonus cards. I think we might be cooked lads. We got... What are we at? 19900? <laughs> That's horrible. <laughs> we have any bonus? We have no more bonus. Oh, we have a lucky three of hearts. Okay. Three discards incoming. Come on, lucky three. It's very simple. We need the lucky three. Oh. <laughs> How about just bonus chips? Not quite. All right. I think, honestly... We got a little too big for our britches on that one. I can understand that. I can understand that. That's all right. Do we want to want to compete? Get some extra money. Maybe this is the right idea here. If we can win in one hand, which might be a little bit presumptuous here. Oh, never mind. We'll get like four bucks, three bucks, enough to buy a cheap Joker that does something, brother. <laughs> 
Okay, Burnt Joker seems like it goes insane. Plus 10 molts, and then whatever you discard first gets upgraded. Am I crazy to think this is a great opportunity to, to lean into pairs a little bit? Pairs are very easy to discard. Sure, we could level up full house, but... Like, why not, why not level up pair, bro? We can always play full house, don't get me wrong, because we're getting plus 10 molt on it to begin with. There's something to hang on. He's cooking something up. He's thinking it through. I think we can afford not to spend. This is me trying to get our econ online. How about two aces? Discard them. Pair gets leveled up. Obviously, we have great flush potential as well. Maybe we should be discarding flush builds, bro. You ever think about that? Bet not. Let's discard our other spades. That's really good. I feel like it's almost an extra flex to take a checkered deck and then not play flushes. Plus <laughs> 10 molt if it contains a flush. Don't get back, Satan! You will not seduce me today! Money's on sale again. Four bucks, four bucks. I'm gonna go simple. Give me a jumbo arcana. Maybe we can fix some stuff in our deck. Um, give me another mercury. I mean, that's. Cr I'd rather just get the a molt on some cards, I think, so we can start cooking them up a little bit. Or maybe some cheps. Maybe some cheps on some cards. Because we already have, like, decent molt coming here. Next Joker becomes holographic. I simply don't think we'll be able to afford it. 9, 10, Jack, Queen, King. Beautiful. It's pretty good, considering we have one Joker right now. Okay, plus 50 chips if it's a pair. I'm just sorry to tell you that uh, 50 chips is not good enough to get me to go eternal mode. Simple, it's the, it's the rules of the game, okay? It's not gonna go down like that. That was not a great hand. <laughs> Flush, it, it's tough right now. Like, the, eventually, pair should outscale everything else we got going on. Well, within reason. Um, we should get some jokers. Like, we we don't want to squander the situation we're in here. Soul card legendary joker! Disables every effect of boss blind. It's, I don't think it's the best, but it's it's fun. Like, it's, it's nice to have. I'm not going to say no. And even cards buff when scored. Don't you go lucky mode, bro. What was I saying? Anyway. We got a good thing. Oh, I was going to say, like, the thing is, pairs are going to outscale everything. They gave us the 20 bucks as I wanted 20 chance. We didn't even have the... Uh, it's oops all sixes and sevens. Austin Powers mode, Joker. Sheesh. Anyway, what I'm trying to say, and I haven't really... Got, flushes score five cards, so even though the molt was lower, there are times that it feels like better to play a flush because it scores five chips. I'm happy now that it's kind of a different situation. I feel I feel very good about the, the setup that we got now. How about Swashbuckler? And it can go at the end because we don't have any multipliers. And then Raised Fist can go at the end. And Raised Fist is, like, disposable at some point, but... Okay, so we are kind of as, as crazy as it is. Right now, we are kind of running pair build. Just some, it, it might limit our overall scoring ability, but it's something that I've never really uh, participated in. So I'm, I'm interested to, to give it a try. I've never... That's one of the things that seems so cool about Balatro, is the idea that you could run these, like relatively like low scoring hands but spec your build in such a way that they can still take off obviously at some we don't we just don't need this because we, we our legendary joker means we're not using any boss blinds anyway or having to worry about any boss blinds choose one choose one i'm a simple man am i a simple man I think I'm a simple man. We have four of everything. Rip twos. You're becoming kings. 
Try to create as many kings. We'll lead as two kings, bro. We'll lead as two kings. Also, by the way, I have a simple rule. Uh, you might say sell the legendary Joker. It's not that good. We're not selling a legendary Joker. That's disrespectful. He was nice enough to show up and give us his time. We're gonna, we're gonna go with it, okay? We're gonna say thank you. And it, it may not be the best thing from an endless standpoint, but we're not point maxing. We're fun maxing. And when point maxing and fun maxing meet, that's great, but I, how, could, how could I get rid of this guy? Look at him. He trusts me, bro. You would have me do that? We're on anti three. Let me make sure I'm not late for daycare. We got 50 minutes. I'm cruising. Let's, let's create a steel jack. High card, so it's not gonna get discarded in order to enable raised fist. We like it. And then go again. One in seven cards get drawn face down, except they don't. Quick little discard on this. I think that the logical step for where we're going, if we're gonna make this run work with pairs, you need to, um, we need to have a mult multiplier. And, funny. Um, we need to have a mult multiplier and we need telescopes so that every celestial pack contains planets. We will not be adding polychrome to a random joker and destroying all other jokers. Not even to our legendary. Okay, we'll lead us two kings. I'm not going eternal mode for that. That's, that's a joke. Foil, not that interested. We're not that interested, I'm sorry to say. We don't need the steel joker yet, so we upgrade pair. I'm being like very sincere. I think the most important thing for us by far is a mult multiplier, which might take us a while to get. So let's just chill and enjoy each other's company. I'm a simple man, okay? I know we're playing kings at some point. At some point, we're going to have too many kings, but... We'll worry about that on, on Anti-11 if we get there, okay? For now, we're just making our deck better. Steel card with a gold seal. They kind of... They kind of clash. Tempting. Um, but that's fine. We'll be happy to have steel cards if we do go pseudo-endless. I really need this freaking telescope, bro. And again, we, the other thing that's very important is we should build good habits. We should always, when we throw a pair, we should be dumping our three worst cards so that Raised Fist gets better until we replace Raised Fist with a Joker that just is better. And I'll, I'll go straight up with you. Oh, you should be here for sure, but I'll straight up level with you, my man. I will level with you. We want tarot cards. Plus four mults. So you're probably giving 20. You're a little bit better than even Steven right now, I think. And now I don't have to pay attention to even Steven. And you're going to give me free tarot cards, which we're going to use to enhance the quality of our deck. It just makes sense. This is good. Fool is good because the death card allows us to make more enhanced kings. There's a sun card, which we're probably not going to use for anything, but so be it. Where's my mercury, bro? Guess what? Four of a kind's getting juiced a little bit. Maybe we pivot off pairs. We start, we start rolling four of a kind. I don't know. I don't know. I don't have a good answer for you. Thank you, Shakot, for your support on this one. Uh, very simple. Discard that. Listen, pairs are super easy to make. You should become a king. I'm, I'm going to sell you for a dollar. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, pairs are easy to make, but it would be nice to buy the voucher that increases our hand size as well. And I forgot, you gotta, well, if you're gonna get rid of your lowest cards, then play it like that. It does pay to pay attention to raised fist. We may want to skip some blinds. Hearts give a one in three chance to give times two mult when scored. The, the catch here, I think, is that we're not going to be scoring that many hearts playing pairs. So I, I, I think that this is less of a multiplicative multiple than it looks like. Just my two cents, okay? So we, we pulled a lover's card for free. That's not bad. And then, uh, I mean, this, this to me looks like a perfect hermit situation. 
We got serious flush five potential with our kings. I want to say, like, what am I missing? But then there's a part of me that's like, don't sweat it, brother. I'm not sure you're necessarily missing anything. You're missing, like, negative jokers would hit the spot. But apart from that, I think, don't even worry about it. I, think, I, I just realized I could discard more, too. You know what I mean? Like, instead of... Uh, Instead of only discarding two cards, I could discard way more to fish for better cards. You're probably saying, duh, but like, <laughs> that wasn't really thinking straight. 17,000, we're straight chilling, no sweat. Totally fine. All right, so I, I feel like we've got, we're in a very secure place. It's a nice position to be in. We have jokers we could easily sell to amp up our score if score amplifying jokers appear. Pair is already level 17. I would love it to go, I don't know, quadruple that if possible. We got a long way to go. Go ahead and use Wheel of Fortune. I had a feeling. I just That one just felt like a nope for me. Maybe too much Dragon's Den lately. And that's why we're not really in the mood to skip uh, blinds, by the way. is because every time we don't skip a blind, we're making... Uh, pair better long term, which is like the only way realistically that we're going to keep this train rolling. <laughs> Do not accidentally play three of a kind. Holy, you go from 280 times 20 down to 50 times five. We're playing this just because it's got gold seal, by the way. We actually, we may never need a chip enabler. Is one of you, a, no, none of you are chip enablers. Holy. So... As of right now, it's, you're tempting! Shoot the moon, you're tempting me, but we're not a queen deck. Maybe if you wanted us to like shoot Uranus, we could talk. Another legendary joker? I can't say no. I'm, I'm sorry. I appreciate the tarot cards, but... Creates a negative copy of one random consumable card in your possession at the end of the shop. That means whatever you're holding here will get duplicated every shop. So we could easily, I mean, just start using your imagination. We could get a Mercury up there, and then we're getting a free pair level every single time. There's there's a lot. That, that's just the very, very start of our ecosystem here. Forget about this, bro. We're not playing any clubs. We buy and we go next. Now, this is not really like what we're looking for. We're not really excited to be leveling up full house, but... At, le at the very least, it's something to sell. And we did level up high card there. That's that's devastating for me. In the sense that I would have le rather leveled up a pair. Donkey, 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 donkey. This should get us there. And they're negatives, by the way. So we can just hold on to them as like an emergency fund and then sell them all whenever we have to. Or use them all if we decide, hey, we got like seven levels of full house just kick in here. So how about a, how about a quick Arcana pack? Fool would give us Uranus. <laughs> Very clever. What about... <laughs> okay, hear me out here. Fool me? Oh, but it's a use, so it would just guarantee that we get Uranus. I hate all of these. I, I'm going to level up two pair. I mean, I, I'd rather level up two pair. No, I don't think that what you're saying makes any sense, brother. Either way, I do want one more hand per round. I definitely don't want an eternal misprint. Although misprint, I think, is a, it's a good joker. Can be, at least. Level up four of a kind. We gotta, part of the fun here is we got to find a way to get, um, to get like a, a good tarot card in our hand. And star is not it, but you could see how in some decks it would be. A spectral pack is tempting, but we remember we're trying to do like as many battles as possible. So that we can upgrade pair even further. I would say like just to keep it as simple as possible. Basically, our goal right now, apart from just blowing up and acting like we don't know nobody, is to get a Mercury in hand that can continually get duplicated. Hate to play a steel card, but it's the way of the world, man. It's the way of the world. And I, I think, like, all of our non-legendary jokers are actually, like, disposable, which is kind of crazy. So if you have a Mercury, use, 
And then you try to like roll until you get a fool card. <laughs> An empress creating more multis. Let me take a look at it. Our, our kings are kind of killing it already. Although I gotta be honest that the scaling on these mults would go kind of insane. So let's just buy and hold this for now. Retrigger all face cards also. I mean, very good for the, the chips and the steel, but we're only on anti six. I think we could wait a minute. I'd rather have Empress than Wild. Just because it's this gives us Molt. This just makes Flushes easier to get. Let's, let's go next. So if anything... Like, uh, we want to basically Molt up the whole deck, I think, bro. Plus the cards just look cool. <laughs> Am I wrong? Tell me I'm wrong! You can't, because they don't. Or they do, I should say. King me. Always wanted to say something cool like that. King me. <laughs> Whoa! Now, I think it's becoming clear. We need a Molt Multiplier. Mercury! <clears throat> Mercury. What a cool card. I'm sorry to do this. You basically have to get sold. There's no other opportunity opportunity to use you. It's still three bucks. Buy and do not use. That's two free Mercury levels every round, brother. We're we're taking this pair build to the freaking moon. I don't even think do we want it. How many kings we got in this? Nine kings. Okay, welcome, welcome to the party, pal. We really need telescopes so we don't have to fish for Mercury. I know we have one in hand. I'm just saying. Okay, I don't know why I'm leveling high card. I guess because I'm also leveling pair. It feels like I should be leveling like low stuff. I'm buying this. So it's okay because we got Mercury in hand. I'm telling you, that's a good one too. And a glass card will go crazy, but I can't buy it because if I buy it, then it might get duplicated instead of Mercury. So you got to do it like this. Extra large blind. It's got me sweating a bit. It's got me sweating a bit. I'm not going to lie to you. Two aces... Two queens left. So we could we could discard anything. Should have done the seven, the nine, and the ten as well. Dump it, dump it, dump it, dump it, dump it. I'm not gonna lie to you. This one could mess us up a bit. Three jacks, one ace. Dump it. Let me see how this looks out. 31,000. Okay, I think we're actually going to be totally fine. Sorry for alarming you. And extra sorry for party rocking. This telescope voucher, I'm telling you, brother. Peace. It is what it is, but you got me a little cheesed. I'm not going to lie. Four of a kind may, may supplant pair in some circumstances. We don't know yet. Empress is good, man. Strength is good, too, if we have kings, but we don't. Okay, we'll just, just molt some stuff up, honestly, that you tend to play. We may be getting close to the point where you have to, like, consider score. Minus one hand size on this one. Also not great. What I, all I mean by consider score is, like, at some point, we have to say, you know what, we appreciate what Raised Fist has done for us. We appreciate what Burnt Joker's done for us. Maybe we even appreciate what, like, we could basically sell every single card we own right now. <laughs> when, we, when we need to jettison them for immediate points. One of the great things about this run right now is that we have like some latent space in order to make the run better. But we do need to see like good jokers to make it happen. And I don't want to burn like so many rerolls to do it. But we'll see. I do think like glass cards... Stone cards could go crazy too, but like glass cards for some molt expansion and then more enhanced cards. Probably you would just, you would take a gl any glass card you could get at this point. Diamonds plus 10 molts. Don't make me laugh. You make me laugh. I'm liable to start crying because I don't, I don't want this one to fall apart, man. You gotta admit, I'm kind of like the clown prince of crime when it comes to Balatro, though. Like, we're, we're seriously cooking up some 
I don't, I'm not going to say I'm the first person in human history that's that's run this build. I'm merely saying pretty fun. <laughs> I guess that's that's all I'm saying. I'm not saying anything at all. First time. We oftentimes say nothing of, of real merit on these videos. More steel cards are critical, even more so than more kings, for sure. Because we don't have anything that multiplies our mult except steel cards. You gotta try, man. I'm sorry, you gotta. You gotta! They're legendary! It might even ruin our... I would rather get it and ruin our run. What the heck does triple lay? Played kings and queens give times two mult each? We're going to the moon. <laughs> they give they give times two mult each, each. That's all I got are kings and queens, bro. She's all sixes and sevens. Check out this crazy action. I'm playing this hand so we can still discard and get another pair level up. Pretty insane, right? Brother. We won't be playing that with this seems pretty good to me. Let, let's just let's just let him let's tickle it a little bit. Let's see what you got cooking over here. That changed our run pretty fast. Now I will say, as good as Pear is doing, it would actually go that's also nice. It would actually go crazy if we could get. I'm just going to buy and use it for the Mercury right now. But if we could scale five of a kind or four of a kind to the same extent, because it's going to level um, the molt way faster, it also allows us to then score more kings. No, thank you. We'll just go next. Uh, and scoring more kings will multiply the molt by even more. I think you, you, you're figuring out what I got going on. So it's, we may try to pivot this to a four slash five of a kind build. Just so that we can keep the, the gas gassing. Don't break on me, okay? Like that, that would be mighty rude of you. It broke on me. <laughs> Still a pretty good hand though. Face cards give more chips. It's going to sound insane, but we really don't need it. We're not saving money. We're just not spending it. <laughs> it's a very it's a finicky distinction, people. I will not be playing a freaking flush this year. You, you're doing me a little dirty on this one. Come on, you got. Uh, I should keep a queen just in case. You see, you really got no pairs for me? Like, what? what is this? Uh, blind melon when there's no rain? Like, give me a little something here. It's a, just a little insulting to suggest that you would toss me something like that. I guess we should put our kings at the end. Of the, well, it doesn't really matter because they're the only cards that got scored there. Sure, it goes crazy. I love that they haven't even given us a choice yet. They haven't given us a situation where we have to choose between, like, uh, Mercury and Mars. Because that'll it'll get to be a tougher decision. Turning a jack into a queen is something. I also feel like just destroying two basic Andrews. It's uh, addition through subtraction. Retriggering on all cards would go insane, but we don't we don't that's like a, a nuclear option and we don't need the nuclear option yet. We should be fine right here. Oh, because we disabled the boss joker. <laughs> Alrighty then. I wanna try something. While we're here, play the pair. And then see if you draw four kings and see what the hand looks like playing four kings instead. This is a good, like, learning exercise for us. <clears throat> I said this is a good... We should risk it. You're going to say we shouldn't, but we, we definitely actually should. Because we're easily going to make... Okay, now... Why don't we still have four hands, bro? I'm telling you. <laughs> I'm going to send it. Don't be silly. There we go. Now, I want to see... Because four kings score. I want to see what this hand can look like. It looked, to me, it looked about as good 
Oh, I forgot this was like higher difficulty too. <laughs> <clears throat> Pardon me. Um, I lost myself for a second there. I'm, I'm a little flabbergasted that you wouldn't just give me the opportunity to... Oh, wait, wait, wait. This is our play. Create two planet cards if one of them's Mars. Oh! <laughs> so let me take a look at this for a second, okay? 38 molt on a pair, 25 on four of a kind. But the thing is, four of a kind scales at three and pair only scales at one. We can also still keep scaling it with Burnt Joker. I think you gotta, you gotta, if you're thinking long term, you gotta get this out here. There is a catch. The catch is that it makes us want to play four of a kind more often, which is like a good thing. The only downside of that is we still only have nine kings. So like it shouldn't be super hard, but it, it's not whole oh, and it's looking freaking sick too. <laughs> and the, the beauty of it for now is that we can keep playing pairs like as they, as they come out and still get like really good value out of them. And then we can like basically fish for the four of a kind. And if we don't get it, we got a good scaffolding in, in pairs. Should really probably just be discarding until we get kings and queens, though. Now that I look at it. So what's 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 our end game here? Use Mars as much as possible. Add more kings and queens, uh, and more steel cards. Basically, at every opportunity. So I'm I'm only spending my money when it becomes very relevant for us to do so. Was that a polychrome Andrew? We got. We got something going. Now again, we could skip for a polychrome joker, but every hand we play, we're scaling. Spicy play. But I don't want to discard my kings just to level up pair. Brother. <laughs> Things you should not do, but I am doing. I am doing them. One more discard remains. Six. I think we need more kings, man. Matthew Vaughn be like, Matthew, uh, editor's note, Matthew Vaughn is the director of the Kingsman films. Okay, so you do retrigger one time, which is nice. Obviously, this isn't like exactly what I was looking for, but it's, it is nice nonetheless. It's a little more than nice, I suppose. I'm kind of hoping to be in the millies at this point, but I think we need... We need a little bit more to get there. Jupiter, Neptune, Earth. Now, these are these are some cards I cannot abide by. We should beat this boss easily. Kings and Queens and Steel cards. I'll add a King. We can't be too picky right now, I think. But you can't buy a lucky card unless you can use it right away. I don't think we're playing these, but maybe it's not, we're not at the right point to be picky. I think we beat this boss easily, but then we need to really start focusing on... I mean, we're leveling up four of a kind, but we're not drawing four of a kind. So maybe it's also time to say, like, Burnt Joker? Goodbye. I, I know I just leveled high card off it instead of pair, but, like, you gotta, you gotta do something, right? The tarot card, death? In, this is exact... And maybe, <laughs> I, the thing is, I want Mars, bro. I want Mars. But if we could turn something into a king every hand, that would go pretty crazy. We also kind of need steel cards, but no. I, I think you gotta, I think you gotta let it fly like this. I think you gotta keep that Mars and just have, have faith. Trust the process a little bit here. I think realistically, this is probably where we start to be cooked though. Insanely cheap rerolls. Now people are really gonna be mad when I don't use them. You are 35 mults on pairs. And on four of a kind, you are two mult. <laughs> so 35 mult. Okay, you know, at a minimum, I think we could say swashbuckler, you can go. We're still looking for the be all end all though. We're looking for answers from the great beyond. Obviously, these are not what I'm looking for. 
We got a dollar reroll. That's that's on the cheap side, I would say. It's a skip in my world. Pluto. I mean, it's two bucks. I really don't expect to play it, but we're in a financially viable position. A negative raised fist. Holy. Earn one dollar at the end. Okay, so it's Hubble Telescope. Negative raised fist, adding malt. One last roll. We need a million points. It's actually so doable, but we have to cook, Jesse. King, king. Dump him. I almost dumped him. Why? Like, because I said dump him. <laughs> uh, <laughs> never mind. We need some support. We need. We absolutely need steel cards in hand. Forget about the tarot card for now. One discard remains. Can't play anything else, brother. Queens add extra score. We should move those to the end, right? Or does it? It doesn't even matter. It doesn't matter because they get scored early. Okay, two kings, three, seven, seven. You, to you, you don't toss the jack because you can't toss the jack. We have so many hands that it feels like it should be a given that we get to a million. That was, was that horrible or am I, did I lose my mind? We need a tarot card. Like, I, I hate to say it. Because the tarot card is the only thing that can help us at this point. Help me. Did it all fall apart? It sucks that the the molt from the kings gets added so soon. We need to draw four kings, three kings on this one. Or some queens that we could turn into kings. Three kings? That's like the one we didn't level up. <laughs> we're done, aren't we? Yeah, I definitely I definitely think we're done. We got close. I, I think we threw a little bit. Maybe we also had an over adherence to our engine without worrying about score. Like realistically, Burnt Joker didn't actually do that much. Except level up our pairs. We should have dumped it for something that added molt probably. But still, I, I had a great time and we're learning as we go. Plus that was on a higher difficulty level. So we unlocked a new deck, bro. We unlocked some new Jokers. The Anaglyph deck is also so much fun. We had it in the demo. For now, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click the like button. Helps out a great deal, and I'll see you next time. See ya!